To transfer stories, Al Hilal have offered Kylian Mbappe a sensational 200 million euro deal to join the club. Mbappe is currently in a high profile contract standoff with PSG and was left out of their preseason tour of Japan and South Korea. The striker has contracted to the French Giants until the summer of 2024, but has so far refused to sign an extension in Paris, with reports again linking him with a move to Real Madrid. Now, Liverpool captain Jordan Henderson has moved a step closer to a £12 million move to Steven Gerrard's Saudi Pro League outfit Al Etifak after completing his medical. The 33-year-old midfielder is set to sign a three-year contract worth £700 thousand pounds a week ending his illustrious 12-year career at Anfield. Henderson underwent his medical in Manchester on Friday and is now waiting on paperwork before the deal goes through. Arnold Dan Juma says it is a second time lucky as he finally signed for Everton six months after sensationally pulling out of a move to Goodison Park at the last minute to join Tottenham instead. The Nigerian-born Netherlands international has joined on a season-long loan from Villarreal to become Sean Daichi's second signing of the summer after the arrival of Ashley Young from Aston Villa. Danjuma changed his mind on the move in January due to managerial uncertainty, but says the history of Everton tempted him to finally join the club. Now, Newcastle have completed the signing of Harvey Barnes from Leicester, forking out £38 million to sign the winger to St. James's Park. Barnes has secured an instant return to the Premier League following Leicester's relegation to the Championship. He seals a move to Eddie Howe's side three weeks after Newcastle reignited their interest in him. Galatasaray have confirmed they are in official talks to sign free agent Wilfred Zaha. Reports indicated that Galatasaray were pushing to sign the 30-year-old forward following the expiration of his Crystal Palace contract. Galatasaray are understood to be working through the logistics that will enable Zaha to travel to Turkey to finalize the move. Now that's it on uh, the transfer stories. Uh, stay with us, there's still quite a bit more to come on the show.